right, Greenleaf fans, I, I'm going to say that this is probably the most requested discussion video that people have wanted me to do after the finale last night. I woke up to a bunch of uh, DMs, but I did not read them because I wasn't able to watch the episode until like 4.30 today, 4.30 p.m. And I didn't want spoilers, believe it or not, despite the fact that I do my reviews and theories and whatnot. But this one I felt was special. And if you watch my episode review, you know I gave the episode a 10 out of 10. I thought it was fantastic from start to finish. A lot of stuff happened. But talking about the last eh, three to five minutes where Grace is praying, well, talking to God at Faith's to, uh, gravesite. And out of the woods, there comes somebody. Wow, I sound like an old novel. It's like, and out of the woods, there emerged. <laughs> but basically, um, a young man comes out of the woods wearing a black hoodie who strangely looks very similar to AJ. Who is this young man? Is he the real AJ? How does he know more about Grace than he, well, probably should, you know, guesstimating? Do people even say that? you know, assessing that uh, Faith is Grace's sister based off the uh, dates on the tombstone and the fact that he just happened to get onto the Greenleaf property by just walking and uh, strangely enough saying what Grace probably needed to hear. I think the main connection is what AJ was telling Faith while they were just, you know, uh, excuse me, while AJ was, what AJ was telling Grace while they were just, you know, standing at the uh, lake versus, you know, what this young man told Grace while she's praying to God at the tombstone, you know, things have an ex expiration date. And then um, Grace asking AJ why he's doing this, you know, turning himself in is like, well, you know, some things, um, you know, just aren't meant to be understood. And it's just like, is this young man who is Kevin McCall Curry? That's his. That's the actor's name, uh, and he's titled on IMDb as Young Man. That's literally the title for this young man. Is he a possible stand-in? Will he? Is he God's answers to Grace's prayers? Will he be the one going to jail for AJ? There are so many things. I think. The biggest question is why doesn't AJ reveal why he did what he did in regards to the pharmacy break in and also why is he turning himself in? That's the big questions here. I mean, if those questions were answered, that might actually give more insight into who this young man is. I, I There are just so many questions to ask. I mean, some people are pointing out, well, don't you find it a bit ironic that, you know, Grace was um standing in front of the church and then AJ comes in in a white t-shirt, kind of like, you know, like he's pure or whatever. And maybe AJ is like a prophet in regards of answering Grace's prayers about her really knowing it. There are so many things to consider. Also, the fact that Noah has not showed up yet, despite the fact that he said he was going to be coming back to you know, um, that neck of the woods, what, in like episode three or four? Yet this was episode 10 and he still hasn't popped up. But according to IMDB, uh, the young man will be appearing in the next episode, which is episode 11 coming out in 2020. And also in episode 18, which is, I believe, the season four finale. Episode 10 was the midseason. Don't at me with that. So this young man will be appearing a couple of more times, but... Uh, at the moment, we don't know who he is. So I just wanted to give my two cents on this. Honestly, I don't know. I, uh, within the past three or four minutes, I kind of detailed who he might be. But I mean, the fact that he knows a bit about the green leaves and just so happened to kind of say the right thing, even though Grace didn't know exactly what he meant, could be God's answer right there. You just never know. So guys, um, thank you all so much. I know this video, I hope this doesn't dis disappoint anyone because I... I know when people, you know, were telling me theories and whatnot, I, I hope you weren't hoping for like a 15 or 20 minute video. I literally don't have anything on this right now. Maybe as some time passes by, I will. But to be honest, I think this video being short and sweet is honestly all it needs to be. And I can't wait to hear your thoughts in the comment section below on who this man, a uh, guy is. Is he someone who actually did rob the pharmacy and AJ ended up taking the fall? Does he know AJ? There are so many questions, but one thing's for sure. 
we're almost at 95,000 subscribers. We need less than 300 people to get there. Go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you're new. Links to all my social media are in the description below. If you want to send a couple dollars my way, it's not mandatory, but also hit me up on Cash App or PayPal. There is a link in the description. Uh, several people have told me they prefer to donate to the channel this way instead of giving money on the YouTube live streams I do, the Super Chat, because when you donate money to me on YouTube, YouTube actually takes a little percentage of that. So if you, you know, want to send me like five bucks without YouTube interfering, PayPal and um, Cash App is the way to go. But also let me know your thoughts on the Green Leaf season finale, mid-season finale, what you think of it. And make sure you check out my episode review for the finale.